Hello everyone, I'm KND. I'm from the Philippines and right now we'll be celebrating Dragon Ball Festival. As we know, Dragon Ball Festival is celebrated at the May 5th of the lunar calendar. To commemorate Chien, we're going to be rowing Dragon Boat and eating Chongzhu. But first, let's row some Dragon Boat. Come on! The name Dragon Boat came from its shapes that resemble the traditional Chinese dragon. And there are many stories about the origin of Dragon Boat Racing. One of the most known story is about Chu Yuan, a patriotic poem. It is said that people in the Chu state were grieving after Chu Yuan drowned himself in the river. That they came to the bank of Miluo River to pay their tribute. In order to protect Chu Yuan's body from the fishes, fishermen searched for his body back and forth in their boats. Later on, Dragon Boat Racing was meant to commemorate Chu Yuan. Nowadays, it has become a tradition and a popular sport. <laughs> it was really exhausting, but it was a fun experience and it was entertaining. And right now, I feel hungry, so let's go make our Zongzi. Zongzi is the most traditional food on Dragon Boat Festival. It can be traced back to the spring and autumn period, when it was first used as a sacrifice to ancestors and gods. Just like Dragon Boat Racing, after Chu Yuan drowned himself for his country, the local village threw Zongzi into the river to protect his body. Zongzi has since become a tribute to this patriotic poem. I also know that in my country, the Philippines, many Chinese Filipinos would also warp and eat Zongzi on the Dragon Boat Festival to add a festive atmosphere. What do you think of this? Uh, it's really hard. It's way easier to eat them. Oh, and then what do you think of Tuan Uche, bro? It's one of my favorite festivals in China. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> and say Tuan Wu Kang with me. Say to the camera. Mm. Dongwu Ankang. Dongwu Ankang. Dongwu Ankang. Tastes really good. It's a good combination. Also, don't forget to pack your own Zhongzi. Wish everybody good health and peace. Bye bye.